What a beautiful day. I'm waiting for my bus to get me to the university. 71, come on. Where are you? Where are you? Talk to continue. Um, the geeks are on board. This bus is rammed. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that bus was packed. I'm free now. I'm free to walk into the university. Oh. Oh, this is what I came for. <laughs> what a beautiful day. What a beautiful day. It's the nicest bloody Brussels day I've ever seen. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah. It's packing out. All right. My favorite talk. I did um, want to try this chat link, but first time I hit it, it was 5.03. I feel like a dinosaur. I, I, I want, wait, I want IRC to, to work. Oh God. I don't know what my username is. So now let's see where a new up and coming fancy new language you also from Last year, we should from last year, can you see yourself? Found some nice swag here. <laughs> Something I actually use. Okay, I'm interested in Grafana. And I'm really like this demo here with the 3D printer connected to Grafana dashboard. I wish I bought a Brusa of um, a Bamboo Lab, but they are, this is like 2,000 euros. I love this project here. I'm going to build one when I get home. It's like a mi microscope with motors so you can scan things accurately. But you don't need the motor. You just need a 3D printer and a Raspberry Pi. I'm so keen on this. I'm so keen. Just absorbing the sun right here. It's just the most beautiful day. Oh my god, we don't even get weather. We don't get weather like this in England. It's so beautiful. I like the catting stuff. Okay. Oh, it's a sass. The curious Esperino, JS, powered, ISP devices. Very cool. Yes. Yeah. But I'm also I'm also holding a talk this evening. So, okay, uh, I can just, get that from the network if you want. I'm just talking to Thomas about uh, Mitch Tastic, and uh, you recommend this hardware here, the Heltec. Uh, yes, indeed, for 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 someone who is starting with the hobby, because uh, this one is one of the latest devices that has come out from Heltec. It uses a very uh, low power processor, the Nordic Semiconductor series. Uh, in contrast to the older boards that use the espressive modules, okay. uh, it takes uh, very, very low power consumption. It is uh, suitable for running and from a solar setup, for instance. Oh, yeah. So, do you recommend a solar panel to connect to it? or uh, solar not, 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 uh, not a special panel, but if you want to do a solar setup, these are the ones to go to because the ESP chips, they use too much power. Perfect, because that's what I want to do next. And how do I, where do you recommend I buy this? AliExpress or? AliExpress or from the manufacturer website. And who's the manufacturer? Heltec. Heltec, yes. Oh, okay. Of course, I want, I, of course if you buy them, uh, make sure you get the mesh testing version. It's the same board, but from the mesh testing version, the core developers get uh, uh, some of the sales. Ah. That's a small okay. percentage. A small percentage. Yeah. Well, I think you're doing amazing work, uh, uh, Thomas. <laughs> awesome. RTL SDR. Yeah. V3. <laughs> that looks cool. Yeah. Um, and so that replaces that one, I suppose. It, it's essentially the same hardware, just with a nicer casing, better oscillators. Like and then, the signal just looks nicer from the start. And to get one of these guys, uh, it comes packaged usually. Oh, nice. Okay, well, I'm really looking forward to explore this. So, thank you.
I like these open monitoring ideas. Monitor all the things. Well, I spent a long time chatting about Tiny Go. It's sort of like uses LLM, uh, not, LL, not large language model, but LLVM to generate uh, the binary. Um, quite interesting. I might use that. Oh, well, look at Gnome. They got a strong, strong merch game here. Really busy here at FOSDEM, and it's nice to meet Mario. Yes, I'm really for it. Oh, who? Thanks for all the YouTube videos, it's amazing. <laughs> Keep on doing it. Keep going. Uh, he's an insane fan. He organizes FOS Asia. Yes. It's in Bangkok. Uh, blue and white. And if you can, I highly recommend you go. It's, a, it's an amazing event, and Bangkok is one of the greatest cities in the world. Enjoy. Tech is open and free. This Amiga is not running Flatback though. No, it's running Gen 2. Oh, Gen 2, right. Oh, yeah. Flatback contained Linux, Core OS, uh, built from Gen 2. And um, I didn't know about it, now I do. So that's cool. Of course, Debian. My God. I got a soft spot Debian. I used to be a Debian maintainer back in the day. Reproducible builds. This should be good too in July. Yeah. Let's go. Well, this is the main strip, and uh, I just spent a good 10 15 minutes chatting to people over at the Fedora thing because I'm running, you know, Asahi Linux, and it was interesting to get my questions answered. And yeah, I'm, I'm, I think I might be a Fedora convert. I'm a convert in the sense that it's powering Asahi Linux, but yeah, I can't get a void. I, I, I'm an archer, come on. Okay, so XL female t-shirt is almost out. This is fascinating to see stock levels like this. I wonder if they do this as Amazon. I love these European architecture, the red brick especially. This other stuff on the other hand, hmm, I'm not sure. <laughs> but everything looks nice in this weather. Flags flying there. This is the shortcut to get to the food trucks. This is the typical place to meet, as, as I was saying. And uh, I can't find my friend now, come on. Lennart's talk just finished, but I think the whole audience was suffering because they went well over 2,800. Uh, CO2, which is frankly not healthy. So everyone felt hot and sleepy here and put a dampener on uh, the keynote. Sadly. Three, so we went from 3,000. Like down here, that's when we were outside. We were outside and then we went inside and then. Oh wow. That is nuts, isn't it? Good morning. Uh, I'm um, running a bit late, day two of Osdem. Didn't go out to delirium, just end, ended up in a hotel bar. Drunk a bit too many beers, but... <sighs> nice chats. It's really nice to be in a town and you can just strike out conversations with strangers, but, you know, talk about tech stuff. That social connection sorely missed really once a year maybe is enough though yeah. I have a few minutes to relay my Asahi Linux experience at FOSDEM I'm at FOSDEM I'm still just just taking a breather and getting some sunshine the um, there are some problems. The wireless doesn't work on this. The wireless has been a bit shaky. This FOSDEM, I believe, um, talking to people, but um, 
it doesn't really work on this. And the worst problem is, is that the battery life, when, 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 when I'm using it, uh, it, it just goes down. It was like two hours. Meanwhile, if I reboot into um, here, yeah. it says four hours, but it, I mean that it just drains down so quickly. So I obviously assumed that Asahi Linux would have good battery life. It really doesn't, and the wireless doesn't work very well. I'm using NMCLI, whatever that means. It just doesn't work. You might be thinking, do I get wireless out here? Yeah, I do. This phone is on wireless right now, so. Asahi Linux disappointing. I'm going to reboot into macOS so that I can get some stuff done, I suppose. To dual boot, this MacBook Air is really painful. You have to hold this down um, for, for seconds, and then you see continue holding for more for startup options. And then finally, it says loading startup option. Then you can let go, I believe. And then you can choose between uh, Asahi Linux and uh, Mac OS. Let me just show you the boot. Since we're at FOSDEM and everything. It has this U-boot thing. And then it goes into... Uh... Yeah. See this U-boot thing and then of course it's got like a whole bunch of text flying by. Disappointingly it uses grub, or whatever. So that's what Asahi Linux looks like. And it's the same process to reboot to, um, to and choose uh, Mac OS. Some buildings in uh, Belgium are beautiful, but not this one. Services Psycho? I mean, is this this, this dry building serving people with mental issues? My lord, I hope not. Feeling targeted right now. I mean, this dry, dreary building is also some mental place. I mean, just just this building right next to it is just weird. It's been concreted up. It's got the ULB logo, so it's part of the university, but still weird as F. Ooh. Well, I decided to come back early. Um, I'm just tired and my voice is going and I got, I got my fill out of FOSDEM. This is cute, isn't it? People just sitting in the sunshine, drinking wine. So civilized here. But usually, don't get me wrong, Fosdem weather is usually just atrocious. So this is really quite remarkable. And uh, next config management camp in Ghent.